Okay, so we're going to do a little experiment here. And that's going to be... Um, you're going to try to shorten 18650 battery. You should not try doing this. This is extremely dangerous. Um, <laughs> I've got one here already struck. Kind of fizzled. It didn't go. So I'm not sure if it was a dud. It was depleted. I don't think it was fully charged. That may have been the reason. So I've got one here. This one is fully charged. I tried it earlier and it was a delayed reaction on that one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this one. I, these batteries are old. Uh, I'm pretty much done with them. Uh, what I've learned is take my axe here and give it a really good... Wasn't expecting that, and that's why I was a little afraid to do it. That's <laughs> what happens when you strike one. That is one hell of a firecracker. That startled me. I'm not going to lie. But uh, let me get some air flowing here real quick. Okay, so this was definitely just an experiment on rough turn in 18650 battery. As you saw... That didn't take very long at all. <laughs> one of them delayed. This one did not. This one went right away, and that's why I used the tool I did so I can keep my hands and arms away from it. So as you can see, that got very violent and very fast. So that's the uh, you know the quote unquote hidden dangers of these batteries. So I'm gonna spin this thing around so we can see the devastation of it. it these are very hot. So I'm not going to touch it. In fact, there's still some stuff glowing red in there. Um, yeah, this, this compound is very reactive when it's uh, ruptured or mixed in properly. <laughs> That's what happens when you hit it with an axe. As you can see, that got really hot that it fried the metal completely on that. Um, not sure what the deal is with the other one, but I'm leaving that one be for now. <laughs> In case it does decide to go thermal, that was a instantaneous explosion. So this is the hidden dangers of lithium ion. You got to be careful with these things. Don't short them. You know, be careful how you handle them. If you put them in your pocket, you know, this is the reason why a lot of people were blown up vapes. Is the batteries were damaged, uh, or they were putting them in their pockets and they were mi mixing with coins and stuff. And causing shorts the other thing you have to make sure is this is the little plastic wrapper logo on the outside but this is a protective film this is actually separating this is holding a separator in the end there and there's a negative here and there's a positive here and so that's protecting that from being able to short that positive uh, if you short that then short that the negative that can cause a thermal too I don't have another one I want to test that theory on, but it's a short clip. Uh, tell me what you guys think in the comments. Thanks for watching. Be safe.